So when you want a warm meal, but you're too lazy to bring up a stove, Stanley's got you covered. Hey folks, welcome back to this video. Just wanna have some fun with you today. Just hiked up a few miles, checked out a further out trail. Usually we go in just a, a mile or two for some blade testing, but we decided to go uh, deeper in. And I wanted to strip down my load so I wasn't carrying as much weight. Uh, and I wanted something warm. I didn't want to just make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So I decided to go with soup. And I've been using this 14 ounce vacuum stainless steel Stanley food jar. Um, these things are pretty inexpensive. They usually run you about $14. Uh, I believe this is an older version. They now have like a white and black one. Um, but uh, pretty sweet little design. Let me just show you kind of how I rock this thing. Uh, it's got a leak proof polymer lid and it is absolutely leak proof. I've not just hiked with this today. I've done several hikes with it now, having soup and chili in it, uh, take it to the office sometimes. And it's a, a great uh, leak proof system. Haven't had a single issue in that regard. Now it's not gonna come with any extras or bells and whistles. So what I've done is just slapped on a Ranger band, a heavy duty, um, what's it called? Uh, rubber band basically. And then I got my Yuko system here, but we're gonna just open this bad boy. There you go. You see how that is really good, large silicone seal right there that you can pull off and clean out. So it's very easy to clean the lid. And again, dishwasher safe, which is like a must in my family. My wife basically will not let me buy anything anymore. If it, she can't throw it in the dishwasher, she's like, I'm not hand washing your crap anymore. So, um, you could actually almost use this like a coffee mug if you wanted to, if that was kind of your thing and you wanted an inexpensive $14 coffee mug. Um, now 14 ounces, uh, most cans of soup are like 16 to 18 ounces worth of soup. Uh, so what I tend to do is just pour out a little bit of the broth, which I prefer to do anyway, because I prefer a thicker, um, I don't like all the soup, you know, like liquid as much. So, uh, we're just going to kind of go in here. I'll just give you kind of a, I'm not going to stick the wand in and give you a you know, temperature test out here in the woods or whatever, but. Mm. Oh, delish guys, seriously. That's perfect temp. Now this is the trick. Stanley says this is rated for eight hours of hot or eight hours of cold. And what I always kind of got frustrated in the past was that I would never see that really with almost any model, regardless of the Stanley, Yetis, Ozarks. I mean, you name it. They never really kept their temperature like they said they would. This is the trick. You got to prime your uh, container. So if you're doing something hot, pour boiling water for about five minutes and let it sit in there with the lid on to prime it so that the temperature of your container is higher. And then you pour your, you know, ingredients, whatever it would be, your chili soup, whatever it is in there. And it will retain that heat for a much longer period of time. And on the flip, if you're doing something cold, throw some ice in there or throw some water, cold water in there, let it sit for a few minutes, pour it out, then put your, you know, iced coffee, put, you know, whatever beverage you're doing in there. And you're going to see a drastic difference in the heat or cold retention of any, and it's not just Stanley, it's any um, company uh, uh, vacuum, you know, whatever. So um, I'll throw in some other basic specs, guys. Uh, it's very simplistic in its design, but I love it. For this type of like day hike, if I want soup and I don't want to have to like boil it and take a can up and, you know, have a cooking container and deal with all the gunk. I mean, this is one and done. I'm going to screw the lid back on. No mess. I'm getting warm soup here instead of having to just do like a mushed up hot peanut butter and jelly sandwich that's been sitting in my pack for three hours. Uh, uh, this is the way to go. In my opinion, it's a little bit on the heavy side for hiking. I mean, this isn't like an ultra lighter thing. It's about eight and a half ounces dry weight before you put your you know contents in there, but double walled stainless steel. Um, again, dimensions I'm throwing in there. So if you're thinking about it, I mean, for, for the amount of money, 14 bucks, you can get six to eight hours. I would argue easily of good temperature, chili or soup on the go. So check it out guys. Uh, links for you below Amazon. I'll throw in some of the other links that we have. We just appreciate if this does connect with you, something you want to try out. Uh, I'll throw some other, you know, insulated, uh, options in there as well, but I'm really digging this little Stanley for the money, uh, gets the job done. And, uh, those will be in those hyperlinks. Appreciate you guys. Uh, check out Instagram, Facebook, all the social media, uh, see what's up and coming over there. Subscribe. If you're not a current subscriber, we're throwing up simple content and super in-depth content all the time. Hope your soup is as warm as mine. Stay equipped, stay prepared. See you guys out there.